Hello fellow YouTubers, and welcome back to Super Mario Sunshine! On the last episode, we continued our collectathon, where we were getting the secret shines and the 100 coin shine, and any remaining blue coins that we had left in Rico Harbor. And we completed Rico Harbor completely, so we never have to go back there anymore. On this episode, we're heading off to the third level, Gelato Beach, which I think might go well. Oh, hello tree! The reason I say I think it might go well is because this is going to be the first instance where there's not a secret shine inside of a secret area. And we're going to find that out, well, after the, that's going to be the second shine we grab. Not to mention, I did find out where all the blue coins were, and the secret shines are relatively easy in this level. The only problem is going to be the stupid 100 coin mission. Because for some reason, Gelato Beach is very unfor unforgiving when it comes to getting coins. So, first mission we go, as you remember, we went inside the sandcastle after a couple of failed attempts to get inside it. Glide, Mario, glide! Glide like you've never... What's the... What's the... What's the poor... What's the past tense of glide? Glid? Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! I'm probably right in the middle of the air. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Oh, don't even think about it, Cataquack. There, this time I'm gonna slide successfully into the... Never mind! Get me inside the sandcastle. Not again. <laughs> I can't do this again. Yes, yeah, we've seen this one. This was an easy one. As you notice, the 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 button's not here. It's not going to be here until I could. I almost forgot that I had the hover nozzle for a moment. There we go. So once again, eight red coins. Let's see what's changed in the past couple days. I'm getting better. I feel better than I did a couple days ago, especially. I think the episode I recorded the the airport one, I felt really terrible. Crap, 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 crap. I said this was easy. I don't want to backfire already. You know, we never really explored the outer the outer side of this level. We basically just went inside and headed straight up. Whoop, where am I jumping? Luckily for us, a lot of these red coins are on blocks that cannot disappear. Oh god, get up there. I have 17 seconds to grab two more red coins. Oh, Mario did the weird jump again. Oh god, oh god, I was I was expecting to land on the on the normal block. Crap, I have six seconds. Get over there, Mario. Whew! Oh, uh, I better be heading backwards right now. Woohoo! Oh, okay. That was that was very scary. It was a small scare, but it was just enough to make my heart skip a little beat. Oh god, look, Mario's eyes are closed. So that was... that went relatively well. Three minutes for a shine sprite. That's not bad. Next one should be even shorter than that. So what was I going to talk about? I don't know what I was going to talk about. I usually try and think of something that I want to talk about before I start the episode. Immediately left my mind. There go, there's my... There's my amazing, there's my amazing memory. Uh, I think we can do it on this one. Basically, you can just go into any level, I think, that it has, that has this one, and we can get it. Now, this is very tricky to find, because if you don't, if you, if you don't spray every single thing on the face of the planet in this game, you're not going to find this one. Kind of like you wouldn't have found this tree that pops up right here. You know, the, the tree that's right there. Unless, unless you literally spray everything in this level, you wouldn't have known about that tree. I just want to get this, because I don't think I've gotten the the rocket nozzle yet. I have not. You know, I don't care. I'll take that. Oh, no, I saved it. Crap. Oh, oh okay, that helps. Well, if I could dive, that would help even more. What I just need to do is I need to get over here. I just got the rocket nozzle, cuz. Just cuz. Get up there. There should be a bud right here. Let's spray this one. We're going to position ourselves very quickly right here, too. Oh, not the... Go away. Oh, and they all just disappeared. Oh, hello! So if you notice, I started spraying the wall there. I'm going to get stuck here, aren't I? Leave me alone, Cataquax. Let's do this again. Spray the bud. Now I want to spray this wall right here. And if you notice, a strike sprite's appearing. And there we go. There's the secret shine that's not inside a secret area in, the, in Gelato Beach. 
So if you need to look for a special secret shine, spray every wall that you can think of. And sometimes it's not even going to be a wall. And we'll get into that in another another level with the secret shine. I have to cough. Please, please let me just get the shine so I can be quiet for a moment. Yeah, I'm not 100% back to normal, but whatever. I did say by Monday I'd probably be better. I just want this to end. It's been going on for almost an entire week. And it's starting to get incredibly annoying. I can't remember the last time I was sick for multiple di for a week. I blame that person. I still blame that person that was sitting next to me. So we're going to go for the 100 coin mission, and we're going to get the remaining six blue coins that are in Gelato Beach. So we're going to head off to the Watermelon Festival because this is the easiest one to get in. And even easy in Gelato Beach is hard by other level standards. Because for some reason, like, the maximum amount of coins you can get in this area is around 110-ish. So if you, if you don't manage to grab a lot of coins, or if you miss a couple of them, you can potentially screw yourself out of this out of the 100 coins shine. There was a mission like that in Mario and Luigi, in, uh, not Mario and Luigi, Mario 64 that did the exact same thing. What level was it? I think it was... Oh, with Jolly Roger Bay. So there's some coins over here. We're going to start with this island because for, for a couple of reasons, there's like 20 coins, I think, on this island. So I want to get them all. Just get these ones on the swing. There we go. And there's going to be some in the, up in the trees. We can see the shadows underneath us. Or, yeah, right there. Of the ones in the trees. There's, I think, three trees here. They each have four. Oh, how did I... Okay, I landed on the... No! I need to get up there. You know, it'd be a lot easier if I just simply used the, the thick tree and then just hover nozzled over to the thin trees. Because there's a there's up there are com some more coins, and there's also a blue coin up there that I completely forgot about. Just hover nozzle over here very quickly. It's, it's a lot easier to crap! It's a lot easier to get up into the big tree than it is to get in these other two trees. Just because of how thin the thin the stump is. Or the the tree trunk is. Oop. Get up there. Oh, it's a nice relaxing. Nice relaxing day! Except it snowed. It snowed up here again. And I was I was getting so used to the 40 degree weather. Especially after Tucson, where it was like 70 degree weather. Oh, hello Mario. Get out of there. Oh, I miss I miss 70 degree weather. I can't wait for it to be like that here in July. Which is clearly a joke, because it, it sometimes gets up to 70 degrees in June! Crap! If I had the rocket nozzle, it would be nice nice right here. But I'm just going to have to stick with this. I mean, it's only been 8 minutes in the episode, and we're already going for the 100 coin shine. So we have, pl we have plenty of time. I just need to make it across that, that tree trunk right there. Or that part of the tree trunk. I got up here when I was looking for blue coins on the first try. Now it's taking me like several tries, but I'm actually playing the game and recording it. There we go. We still might get to stand on one of these. Yay. Yeah, blue coin right there. So please just grab the blue coin and not fall through. Oh, I've already saved it. That, that, doesn't, that doesn't give me permission to start saving it every time, though. That's because I screw up once doesn't mean I should start, I should just disregard that rule I set. Grab that, and I don't think there's any coins inside the coral reef, so there's no reason to go over there. <laughs> what we get to do now is we get to knock out every single cataquack, so that should be fun. Let's get over here. This is also, I'm assuming, where the star is going to appear. Just because most of the star, the stars, most of the shines that we've gotten in this level have appeared on this little peninsula right here. Or whatever it's called. Whatever the correct terminology is for that thing. Goodbye. Give me that. I also need to make sure which ones I jump on. Not not really, because I don't plan on going through the beach again. Oh, 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 oh. I also gotta remember that I need to go underneath the underneath the cabana. Over there. Because there's some coins underneath the underneath the deck in the back. And you can also get coins for destroying watermelons, so that's another reason why I picked this level. You can only get like seven to ten water watermelons. Seven to ten coins from each watermelon. And I think there's only three watermelons that you can destroy. So you can sometimes get up to 30 coins that way. We were already at 26. 
I've already gotten like most of the Cataquax. Destroy. There we go. This is this is gonna take a little long right here, just destroying the destroying these, but it's a it's a necessity. We get I'm gonna just destroy this one until we get enough coins, and I'm gonna head upstairs and start getting a couple more blue coins. We're gonna need to find Yoshi too. Yoshi is a must for some of the blue coins here. Oh! Oh! Right, he's gonna be. Let me jump on him so he he stays stunned longer. Please stay stunned longer. As soon as I stop getting coins, I have 30 coins. We might get this episode done in 20 minutes if I don't fail tremendously near the end, because we're gonna need to go on these tight ropes up here. This is why this level can sometimes be a very troublesome because if you fall from those tight ropes. It can take you like two to five minutes to get back to where you were. I'm almost, I'm almost nervous of taking the rocket nozzle with me. Oh, he's gonna be right, right on top of the mushroom, or er, mushroom, watermelon. Oh, thank you, thank you, Cataquack friend. This might, that might have been the last coin we would have gotten. Nope, one more. Well, let's not, let's not tempt fate. Let's try again. Oh, blow up, blow up. Oh look, another coin. How many coins have we gotten from this thing yet? I think we've gotten like several. Oh, we didn't even do anything to the Cataquack. Okay, we just got them all. Let's move on up here. Thank you, Cataquack. There's more. You launch us up to your your brother, which we can now knock out and get coins from. There's also, I think, some coins down here where we found that secret shine. Four coins down there. Not to mention there is one of the bulbs or one of the buds that we haven't sprouted yet because we haven't had the ability to yet which is why we need Yoshi should be coins down here yes and now that emblem is gonna appear there forever now after you get the after you get the shine sprite so it, it 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 just lets you know that you did get that shine in case you were forgetting although granted if you have every single shine in gelato beach you should know that you got it go away see we're already almost at 50 coins I just need to make sure I get the next 50 in about eight minutes. Another watermelon right here. I think there's also some coins inside this thing right here. Oh, got a cough again. Hold on one moment. So nice. I cut out my cough so people don't have to hear the disgusting sound that comes out of my mouth. Although if I wanted people to not hear the disgusting sound that came out of my mouth, I'd cut everything. Oh! <laughs> Self burn. Okay, what what does Yoshi need? Where is Yoshi? Where is Yoshi? He should be like over here, I think. No, 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 no. Yes? Oh god, I don't know where Yoshi is. Help! Why didn't I find out where, where, where Yoshi was? I have a feeling he's over here somewhere. Like in between that and this. There's a bumble. There's a beehive right there. Oh, I can't believe I, I can't believe I cannot remember where Yoshi is. Is Yoshi even in this mission? I feel like a moron right now. I should have found out where Yoshi was. He might be upstairs. No, he has to be somewhere where I could potentially have to bring durians to. I already got that one. And he's not by. He might be by the. The cabana. He's probably not in this level. Not when I think about it. At least the at least this the watermelon festival. Oh, I think I saw him. Did I just see him? No, I just saw Durian. Crap! Well, this isn't good. Well, I still at least know where the blue coins are for him. I just need to find out what level he's in. So I can use that. We'll let's still go for the 100 coins. Since we're already halfway there. We're not going to just stop that now. Let's go behind here. Like I said, underneath this deck is, is about, I think, 7 coins. We did get a blue coin down here before. Speaking of which, how many blue coins do we have in this area? We, need, we still need to collect 5. 2 are Yoshi specific. And the other three I can get. I should use the rocket nozzle to get those ones. It'll be a lot quicker. I don't need to worry about 
if I fall, backtracking a long distance. In between getting next, in between getting the shine and arriving back in Delfino Plaza, I should probably find out where Yoshi is, or at least what levels he appears in. I have an idea. Actually, I have a lot of ideas, but none of them are, seem to be true. For instance, I thought, I thought he was. I thought he'd be over here somewhere. I thought he'd be over here. Seriously, where is Yoshi? Come on. And now I think he's in one of these trees for some reason. I don't think he is. Also, oh no 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 oh no that's a that's a cataclysm. I thought that was Yoshi. I saw the Z's and got excited. Oh yeah, plus there's that blue coin that's way up there. Not to mention all the coins that we can get from that. So let's go get let's go get the rocket nozzle right now and take advantage of that. Not to mention there are some coins over here by the rocket nozzle. Nope, 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 nope. There we go. Okay, to the hut we go. Hopefully I can just get this in maybe one, maybe two tries. The bees are going to be annoying because they're going to be stinging me while I try and launch off. Just like that. No, I missed the coin. I missed every coin. No, I missed the blue coin. I got all the normal coins. I just need that blue coin. There we go. Now we have 26 blue coins in this area. Only four more left to collect. Two are Yoshi specific, so I'm just gonna try and get up here. I just need to get up on this walkway. I don't care if I slide off, because there's gonna be... Well, this one I can get 10 coins from by itself. Uh, I don't think I need to do any more watermelons. I mean, I did say that there's like 110-ish yellow coins in this area. But there's a blue coin right here. If only I would've grabbed that. That, if I would have grabbed that, that tightrope would have taken me all the way to where I need to go. So I'm going to try and go for that. I'm moving low in water. Oh god, camera. What was that? No, 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 no. Don't slide. I run out of water before I get this. Mario, quit sliding. No, 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 no. I hate you, Mario. I tell you one thing and you, you disobey. You're like a, you're like a teenager. A rebellious teenager. Come on, let's get on this. Let's get on this tightrope now, Mario. Ah, crap! I almost got on that tightrope. That that one wouldn't have helped. Maybe I think if I just start from here. No, he missed. He missed. He missed. Get over here. I don't want him to slide. So I'll do anything to make him not slide. Oh, I missed it completely. I have one more go. Yes! Ah, oh, last try. I am... I don't think I have enough to propel myself up again. So I'm just gonna take this all the way. Oh, no. Am I even gonna be able to get these ones over here? Here comes the backtracking section. I'm not gonna be able to make this, aren't I? I'm gonna need some water. <laughs> if I would've just made it one jump earlier, I would've been able to get this. Now I have to be very careful where I jump. There's, there's some coins up there. You can already see the blue coin. Get on that tightrope. Yes, okay. I think there's a couple coins down there, too, so... When I get those coins, I just can simply jump back down there. And grab those coins. There's also coins up in the air. You can see five right there, and there's another two. A little closer to the cabana. Oh, that might be another five. Those are very, very hard to get. I've never actually gotten those five near the bottom. I've tried... Ah, no! I don't have enough water. See, that's the that's the big mistake you can make. You can just you can just ultimately fail jumping from one of the tight ropes. Get up there, Mario! Get up there! Get these coins right now! Whoop 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 whoop! Hold on, got a cough again. Oh, this is gonna be so much fun editing. I'm at least warning myself when I cough instead of having to. When I, I cough in the middle of talking. It's nice to get some warnings for future me. Future me likes warnings. 
probably warned that I'm about to fail again. Let's not try and cut anything today. It's been 20 minutes, so I've been going for the shine for about 12 minutes. It's not that bad. It could be a lot better. Ooh, okay. This right here. I need to get this. All I need to do is get this blue coin, and I can just ignore the rest of the tight ropes. Woohoo! Okay. Oh. This is another heart pounding moment. Yes, we got it. So that that just leaves us the two blue coins from Yoshi. The only problem is we need to find Yoshi now. He's also the highest point in Gelato Beach. See, I don't think I can use the... Oh no, not this. I don't think... Yeah, I can't use the rocket nozzle from way up here. See, look, I tried diving. I don't, I don't have enough momentum to get all the way up there. Surprisingly, even though I dive, Oh, I should have dove into the sand. I could have Mario's head completely submerged in the sand. Okay, well, we just gotta find coins now somewhere. I don't know why, I did not expect coins to appear there. I don't know why I, why I sprayed it. Oh, I got right underneath the stupid mirror. Okay, let's destroy this watermelon. Very quick. I said quick. No! We need 15 more coins. We can get 20 from, I, at least 20 from these watermelons. So let's pop the watermelons. We'll just, we'll just pop watermelons for the rest of the rest of the level. Pop it. Pop it. Pop the super watermelon. There we go. Any of the coins that I could be missing. Other than the 10 that's in the air over there. Well, all the birds, the birds have coins too. If I would, if I would spray them enough. Why can't I crush this watermelon? There we go. Let's see, are there any cataquacks I missed? I don't think there are. There might be. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't necessarily comb the entire beach for cataquacks. God, they, I always knock the watermelon. All the way over here. All I just need to do is walk into the building. And not at an angle. Oop, 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 oop. As long as we get this this shine done. Because this shine is probably the most time-consuming shine in the game. Just because of how many coins Gelato Beach has. And the and the, the things you need to do to get all the hundred coins. I think the next the next hardest I think is. Pianta Village, I, I assume? Serena Beach is a little hard. And, uh... Yeah, Serena Beach, Serena Beach and Pianta Village are very hard when it comes to getting 100 coins. Pitta Park and Noki Bay are incredibly easy. You just need to take advantage of the fact that Noki Bay and Pitta Park are both two separate areas when it comes to the map. Technically, Serena Beach is two, but there's not a lot of coins outside the hotel. So it doesn't necessarily count as a second area. You know what I just thought? I'm gonna get the I'm gonna get the hundred coin way at the top of the level. I'm gonna have to fall all the way back down and get over there. I'm trying to think if there's any closer coins that I can get. Oh, well that one's out. I just need five more coins. Did I miss any of you? Not you. Not you. Not you. Okay. 100 coins, here we come. We just need five more watermelons to be destroyed. Sacrifice to the, the coin shine god. There we go. This one should be easy just because this one's incredibly fragile. Hurry up and grow. It's the biggest one, so we have to wait for it to grow. There's two. I just need to try and remember. I think I know where Yoshi is. It just comes down to what mission I use. I think if I use the... If I use the... Not the Sandbird mission. But the Coral Reef mission. That one will work. Alright, we got one more. Or two more coins to get. Here it comes. Here comes the 100th coin. 
taking us 15, 17 minutes to get this coin mission completed. No, pop. Why am I pushing it that way? Pop, why, why am I, why don't you pop? There we go. Oh, don't you dare disappear. Hey, look, I was right. It appears there. <laughs> I'm one for three now. Oh, I, I ran right into that. No! I wanted to dive past it. All right, let's just let's just slide right into it. Stupid Yoshi's not popping up. All right, let's continue. I'm trying to find out where Yoshi is very quickly. Okay, let's head back into Gelato Beach. Okay, I know where he, I know where he is now. It, it's the mission I thought it was. So basically, I would have had to come here anyway. And he's probably going to be exactly where I thought he was. Yep, I can see him already. Nope, I was just seeing the sunglass guy. If I recall correctly, he should be over here. Right? Right? Please tell me. No, 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 no. He's over there. He's, he's, he's where the shine appears. And he needs pineapple. Okay, we can find one of those inside this house over here. There we go. I think the coconut and the durians are in different places. I guess there's a little cash here. Yeah, there's a little cash register right there. We're just gonna simply no one's no one's looking at it, so we'll just take this fruit. Let's just let's just avoid the avoid the goop there. If you've seen Super Mario Sunshine Versus, you know exactly what that goop causes to happen. And since you've seen this let's play, you know exactly what we what we're gonna do with that goop once we get Yoshi. Hello, Yoshi. Let's not run into the water. <laughs> we just have two more two more coins to get with you. And we can call this episode done. And we can call Gelato Beach done. And we can call most of the episodes, or most of the areas we've been in done. Other than, most, more than half. Let's spray this one. Luckily, Yoshi's juice does affect those as well. As you see, there's six coins down here, plus that blue coin. That would be nice to do. If we would have had the chance to get it during the watermelon festival. Get there. Let's hit it from a distance so they don't ignore they don't they don't start getting us immediately. We hit it from here. Why isn't the thing falling down? I'm gonna use all of Yoshi's juice before I get a chance to get rid of this. Go! There we go. As I mentioned, getting all the bees would have helped too, with getting all the 100 coin missions. There we go, and, oh, last blue coin, 190 blue coins, look at that. So we now have 100% of the items in Gelato Beach. Let's take a look at this, woohoo! We're doing very good, I mean, let's see how many blue coins we have left to collect. We have two, one left to collect in Peanut Park, and we know where it is. We don't have any to collect in Serena Beach. We have, well, we had a lot in Noki Bay to collect. We have, we have 18. In the Pianta Village, we have two. So, 18 to, plus whatever we have to collect in Corona Mountain and Delfino Plaza. So, let's leave the level. I think this episode went really well. I was, I was very afraid of how long the Gelato Beach 100 coin mission was going to take. I did kind of plan it out a little bit, but even then I forgot some coins that were very easy to grab. Actually, no, I didn't forget any coins. I just didn't grab them when I could have. But, like I said before, we now have everything <laughs> done in, Gel in Gelato Beach. So, on the next episode of Super Mario Sunshine, we're going to be heading over to Penna Park and start the collectathon over there. Getting the two secret shines there, the one blue coin we have left, and the 100 coin shine, which will actually be... Very quick, if, if I know Pinna Park. So, until next time, hopefully you enjoy. Kind of cheap, but it works. Uh, 
Let's do it again. <laughs> that is so cheap. It works. I like it. Oh, he hit me. Get him. There we go. 